Hey, this is Casey at Schaefer Chevrolet, and this is our 2015 Toyota Camry. Um, just going to do a quick little walk around video here, start on the inside. Uh, so the first thing I was looking for was to make sure it has Bluetooth, and uh, as you can see it does. Um, those are some of the past uh, devices that had been uh, paired to this vehicle. So it is something uh, that this vehicle has, is Bluetooth. All you got to do is click the uh, add button there to put it on. Uh, right now I got the air conditioning on full blast, and uh, it's nice, real cold air conditioning. All that's good. Um, we haven't detailed and cleaned the car up yet, so it's a little bit dirty. We got, you know, we got to vacuum it, wipe it all down, and do our thing to it. But uh, it's going to clean up really, really well. Um, definitely don't suspect any uh, or see any like sort of signs that it was a smoker's vehicle or anything. Um, like I said, just after we get a regular detail done on it, it's going to look really, really good. There's no uh, like check engine lights or anything of that nature on there. 85, 901 is what the odometer says. Um, then we've got the, village contest sponsored by the radio. That, that all seems to be working just fine. And the windows are all going up and down just fine. The power mirrors. Are working so uh, all the electronic stuff uh, looks good um, the key fob that has a button for the trunk um, and I tested that out that all is working good you can see the cruise control turning on and off um, so yeah I mean everything looks good like I said just needs a regular uh, clean up and um, it's gonna be a really nice clean vehicle now on the outside looking for like dents, sting scratches you know right here by the by the handle i see this on like every single car i don't know why or what it is but there's always scratches like in this little area um on i mean on my personal vehicle and on like every other car i look at on a car lot for some reason uh it seems to be that way um and then you know i'm just looking at like i said looking for any dents, sting scratches and at, while I'm next to it, the tires, um, I would say, yeah, they are m mostly worn. Um, they do seem like they have enough tread to where they would have passed our inspection. So it might be something you'd want to do before winter. Um, I, by no means are they like bald tires or anything like that, though. They still have some life left on them. Um, just most of it's been used up. Now the hood, the hood, uh, Looks pretty good. The front bumper area looks pretty good. You know, we got to get the bugs off of it. Uh, again, just, you know, get it all cleaned up and stuff. I see a couple, like, random little scratches here and there, but nothing, uh, nothing serious. There's a spot right here um, where... You know, I don't know, it's maybe five inches long. And um, I'm thinking maybe when that uh, goes through the body shop, because typically we put a car like this through the body shop and like polish them, buff and touch them and stuff. And usually, you know, areas like that clean up some um, and either go away or dramatically improve. Probably the, the biggest scratch I see is uh, one right here on the door it's it's fairly long i mean we're we're talking from like there to about there um all in all probably i don't know a foot long or so maybe a little more uh but again it, it may uh buff out or dramatically improve and from a distance i mean if you're like looking for it you see it but if uh you know, at first glance, it you can't really tell it's there. Um, but all in all, I mean, it's definitely values there. Another way we do our pricing and stuff is we, we take, um, you know, the condition and stuff like scratches or dings, dents, stuff like that into consideration when we do our pricing. Um, so it's not like, you know, we've got it marked up 
with thousands of dollars worth of profit in them. I mean, we, we sell these things at a low profit. We do high volume, about 200 cars a month. Um, so, like, even if someone was to, to spend money fixing this car, even if you spent, say, $1,000 um, fixing some scratches, you'd still be ahead uh, with as good a price we have, about $2,000 below book value. So... Um, all in all, yeah, it looks like a like a nice vehicle. Um, other than you know, like I said, there's there's a few spots, but it may uh, clean up pretty well when uh, when we get it through the body shop, and um, you know, I can definitely follow that and keep tabs on it, and see you know how that looks. So, thank you for uh, watching the video, and uh, have a great day.